to die. They all deserve to die. A devastating explosion in the harbor this evening may not have been an accident. We have learned that evidence of a fierce gun battle has been found by police investigators. Several bodies were recovered from the scene with bullet and shrapnel wounds. So far, no one is commenting on exactly what happened here or why. Talking about. It was Alma at one origin. 
All right, Tony, get moving. Fennel's got to be close.
contact with my recon team, and the brass wants me to send in more men, which I'm reluctant to do until I know what we're dealing with in there. My orders are to secure this guy Fettel. Getting rid of him will break his telepathic link to the soldiers. Once they no longer have an objective, they should shut down. That sure would be nice. Tell you what, can you spare a chopper? We're seeing what looks like a full-scale withdrawal. My gut tells me Fettel's on his way to Harbor Camp, so maybe we can help each other out. Can do.
Somebody needed a ride. Got an HLZ for me yet? I'm showing a decent sized yard just ahead of my point man's current position. Only problem is there's an enemy gunship system there at the moment. I'll keep you advised. Roger.
one little word on Jankowski. It's like he just vanished. The weird thing is that the bodies of the Delta team he was with are all accounted for. Thank <laughs> you. 
stay out of my way. Personnel. We 
We've been unable to confirm the precise nature of the crisis, although at least one official has suggested that it may involve terrorism. Let's go to Diego Rodriguez, live on the scene. Thanks, Phil. We're being told that just before 5 p.m. today, gunfire was reported at the downtown headquarters of Armacamp Technology Corporation, a major defense contractor. Now, what followed is unclear at this point. U.S. Army helicopters were seen approaching the building, but we've heard nothing since. Police are urging citizens to remain at home and say there is very little danger of the situation spreading outside of the cordoned area. Phil, back to you. That was Diego Rodriguez coming to us live from the police blockade downtown. Today's crisis at Armacam comes on the heels of a report that one of its vice presidents was kidnapped at gunpoint this morning on his way to work. Police are refusing to speculate as to whether the events are connected. Don't shoot! My name is Norton Mapes. I I'm an engineer. Shit, it's a civilian. Give him a comm link. Hello? Who are you people? The good guys. Are you alright? Oh, sure. I'm having a hell of a time. You said you're an engineer? Can you help me get into the network? What am I, an IS lackey? Tell you what, you disable the local security system, and I'll see what I can do about the server. I can disable it remotely once I'm logged in. No, you can't. It's on a separate network. It's back that way. Why do you want us to bring down the security system anyway? Never mind why. You want my help, that's the price.
That Mapes guy was right about security being on a separate network. I can monitor the camera feed, but I don't have any direct access to the system. Separate, but we are one. a prisoner floating in darkness like the unborn in the womb soon i will find her and i will set her free shit i lost him again fuck There was a lot of anger in this room. That's great. Got anything useful to add? I don't see any bullet holes. There's no brass lying around either. These guys didn't fire a shot. Then what killed them? I don't know. Well, figure it out. All right, buddy, get moving. Battle's gotta be close. I'm not even sure where to start. Watch your back. <laughs> 